Now, say you didn't really want to do much broad changing to your effect, but you wanted to do something like go up and get up and down, up and down like this for the entire song. This is called low frequency oscillation. Oscillation is basically when something goes back and forth, back and forth, low frequency, and that you can actually count how long it takes. Because in, in normal science, oscillations are usually in hertz, and hertz are really, really fast. So low frequency oscillators are what you'll use to control the effect to doing this in a very specific speed and fashion throughout the whole song. I'll show you how. Using the same piano sound as the last clip, I uh, put in a simple bass line. And I'm using the, I'm using the uh, frequency, the low, low pass filter as we have been using. We're going to do the same thing as we did with the automation clip. We're going to make an automation clip. Now I'm going to put this in here like that, and then we're going to make the automation clip fit to that line. It's going to be eight measures long. You're going to click on this tab right here, this tiny little tab, and it's going to bring up this menu. You're going to want to go to channel settings, and there's a little button here called LFO. You're going to hit that, because LFO stands for low frequency oscillator. And now the line that there would have been turns into a wave. The wave is the position of, of the effects uh, in time and in, in amplitude, and the, the speed is how fast it's going to be gone. The level is how up or down it'll be at any given moment. Tension will turn it more into a sine wave from a triangle or the opposite of a sine. The skew or the pulse width, and this is this is kind of the kind of effect it sounds like.